we will go to the next part that next what will be called as the topic which we have discussed today is the mutations and their types of mutations and their relation between the mutations and their mutagens but in order to start the mutagens in order to start the mutagens topic we have to study what actually the mutation is and what are the types in order to read see this is the this is the concept and this is the topic that we have taken that we have making the complete uh, description here is to make and to understand what actually the mutation is and what actually the purpose of the mutation is and where it occurs see mutations to define uh, not to define to describe and to in detail uh, to detail explain all the mutations mutations as well as the mutations characters and those types of characters we are putting towards the mutations as well as types of types of mutations the first thing is called as see uh, to define what actually the mutation is the topic that we have taken here is a mutation right this is, this is see this is the type of a mutation where it occurs and what are the types of in it see mutations to define what actually the mutation is see definition what to write or what to describe and what to explain see mutation it is one of the see it is a process and it is not a continuous process it is a direct as well as it is a spontaneous or it is a sudden write down see right you can write see it is a spontaneous as well as a permanent change in the human body which alters the character of an individual right which alters the character of a character of an individual see whenever a person is got mutant when whenever a person is got mutated by some of the ultraviolet radiations or some of the x rays where the uh, the man is completely growing towards the mutation so see to explain what actually the mutation here is we can take the example of uh, see the sequence where they have see to, uh, to explain the mutations Right, to explain the mutations uh, example we have to describe we have to know where it happens see the mutation occurs in the sequence of a so nucleotide sequence of a dna see if it is a dna see if it is a dna we have a dna or the genetic transfer for the genetic information carriers those genetic information carriers will be called as see dna factors as well as dna cofactors and that but to define what actually the cofactors are see we have to this uh, we have the example of we have an example of what we have an example see we have an example of huh, what we have example see we have taken the example of a nucleotide sequence that is a gaz see this is one of the sequence that we can see in the mrna see this is the type of sequence that we can see in the mrna see this is the original sequence that we are seeing but when the mutation occurs in any person if it is a sequence of a human consider it is a sequence of a dna sequence of a human being then if it is mutation occurs then it has been replaced by see, G, G has been saved but the here this gonine and then uh, thymine as well as uracil in presence of gonine it will be uracil in the case of mRNA but it is not in the presence of the DNA but here in the case of anion it will get replaced by the or it is will get replaced by the uracil see uracil coralis or see and uh, adenine is completely replaced by the uracil this is the process where the complete mutations takes place in the human body which can completely alters the human see what is the resultant of this what is the result see the result when the mutation occurs in a human body it can be any syndrome it can be any disease it can be any criteria which is not useful at all which, is, which may be leads to the death which may not be leads to the death for example we have taken this one GAC as well as GUG this is one of the best example where mutation occurs in the, the nucleotide nucleate sequence of the gene see we have an example of a sickle cell anemia see we have an example of a sickle cell anemia see it is one of the diseases which was caused by the concave shaped the clotting as well as the Concave of red This is the same cells which directly affects on the red blood cells, which makes the human to death. See, that is one of the syndrome which was caused by the mutation. So, see, this is one of the mutation and their perfect example. Not only this, we have another one that is called as a Klein filters syndrome. See, it is also one of the best example. We have a Down's syndrome. See, we have also we have an example of a Down's syndrome. See, these are some of the examples then we have also there is a hemophilia remember hemophilia is one of the best example for the mutations see these are the syndromes these are the symptoms when a person is got affected by the mutations he can resist he cannot resist against these these diseases okay these effects and these 
syndromes in the case that see this is one of the mutations in the mutation occurs in the human body these are the syndromes that you can see in the organism that you can see in the human body of an organism see this is a mutation okay that see that we have according to our syllabus we'll be moving to the next part that next part will be called as a types of mutations okay already we have know that there are types of uh, what there are types of mutations those are the see those are the types of mutations we will discuss here the types of mutations for our syllabus that is first one is called as a chromosomal mutations see one first one is called as a chromosomal mutations then we have gene mutation see these are the two types of mutations that we can see or we can happen the process can be happen in an organism the process can be happen in vertebrates as well as invertebrates see or see gene mutation it is also called as a point mutations remember okay it is also called as a point mutations the name itself it indicates what actually the mutation it prefers so see chromosomal mutation see chromosomal mutation is a type of a mutation where mutation occurs on the complete set of a chromosome or a single set of a chromosome see to define chromosomal mutation it is a type of a mutation where mutation completely occurs on right how occurs on the chromosome that is called as a chromosomal mutation that is called as chromosomal mutations okay what actually the gene mutations are gene mutations are the gene mutations where mutations occurs on the allele or the gene of a chromosome which is located on the chromosome see this is the centromere and these are the two alleles see this is this is a structure of a chromosome right this is a structure of a <coughs> what this is this is the structure of a chromosome here there is the presence of a centromere within this this is the presence of a locus here the locus is a point where alleles or genes has been present on the single chromosome right this is the presence where there is a presence of a gene remember there is a presence of a there is a presence of a gene over here right this is the presence of a gene over here see and then we have uh, this point this is a this is a percent this is the main uh, uh, this is the point where the gene mutation has been takes place the complete mutation has been done on the gene of a chromosome exact gene or locus which 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 bears the gene on that particular mutation so see this is called as a gene mutation but we are not going to study about for now see for uh, for today's sake we are not going to study about the gene mutations we are only preferring for chromosomal mutations that for today's class but for after some time for after completion of this we will be dealing with the next chapter after that see then we will start with the chromosomal mutations and what are the types of chromosomes and what, where it will be happened and what are the conditions which can which you can see what are the chromosome if chromosomal mutation has been occurred in the human body what are the main process what are the main uh, syndromes that we can see that we can came across about uh, see there are n number of syndromes there are n number of diseases that we can see okay there are n number of syndromes there are n number of uh, syndromes that we can see when chromosomal mutation occurs see the first thing will start with the chromosomal mutation see what are chromosomal mutations then best example for chromosomal mutations here there are four types two types under this chromosomal mutations there are two types of chromosomal mutations see if a mutation occurs on the exact chromosome that is termed as a chromosomal mutation if mutation occurs in the chromosome if there is a morphological change if there is a physical change of a chromosome if there is a if there is a any change in the morphological character or physical character or physical appearance of a chromosome then it is grouped under the morphological remember that is a morphological chromosomal morphological chromosomal mutation if i don't leave the mutation occurs on the exact chromosome only there is a change of there is a number of a change of a chromosomes and leads to certain types of diseases or syndromes then it is called as see then it is called as a numerical numerical chromosomal mutation numerical chromosomal mutation these are two types of what these are the two types of mutations under the chromosomal mutations in what based in their base either it is a change of a physical either it is change of the number of a chromosome see the first thing will be said here that is uh, again we have four types under the morphological chromosomal mutations again we have two types under the numerical chromosomes see the first and foremost example we will take see i will write once again 
why I have been this. See the first thing under the morphological chromosomal mutation. I will write here. See what are the morphological chromosomal mutations under the chromosomal mutations.